Good. Hey guys, it's Gary from Green Mountain CrossFit. Uh, we're here to talk about um, event number three on Sunday. This event is for masters and open athletes. This is called Duck Trails. There are two scores, um, a combined time for a run and then max reps. Uh, so how we will start here is all four athletes will start in a hoop. Um, I should say that the run will be outside for this event. We're showing the, the duck walk as an outdoor event, but very possibly the duck walk will be indoors, right? The run will be outdoors and the duck walk will be indoors. So just keep that in mind. Um, we haven't quite decided how we're gonna play that out yet on Sunday. Good, so three, two, one. Two athletes are going to be tethered together. They're gonna be both holding on to a green resistance band. Both athletes must maintain hold of that band for the entire run. It is an 800 meter run. So three, two, one, those two athletes will take off on their 800 meter run. In the meantime, one athlete will stay in the hoop for rest, and the other athlete is gonna start their duck walks. Duck walks will look like this. Is, uh, one athlete has to travel 50 feet before you can switch. There'll be a cone or marker every five feet. Every five feet that is, that is crossed will represent one rep. Sara's gonna bring that all the way back. So, out and back, 50 feet is going to be 10 reps. Every five reps is one uh, rep. When the runners get back, our runners are back now from their 800. Their time will be recorded. The score will be recorded. There will be a one minute rest, and then athletes will switch. The two athletes that were doing the duck walk will now grab onto the green band and run after the one minute rest. And then the other two athletes will start their duck walk. Same, uh, same rules apply there. So, any questions on that, please let us know and we'll see you guys on Sunday.